sendiri dan Good morning So I ordered a bunch of stuff online to paint And don't get me wrong, I am no artist I cannot draw or paint But I love it and I chose to do it today because I'm in Texas, so it's usually like 100 degrees out every day. And today it's 82. I don't know why, but it actually looks like overcast, so it might rain. But I'm going to take advantage so I can be outdoors and paint and have a cup of coffee. And I feel like it'll just be relaxing. And my pup's here. You want to say hi? You want to say hi? Say hi, mommy. Hello! Over there! Okay, so I bought an easel so I can uh, prop my canvas on something while I paint, so I'm gonna set that up. A bunch of different size canvases um, and to be quite frank with you online they looked a lot bigger I should have just looked at the measurements I thought they were gonna be like normal size and I got this size and then just wait till I open the pack there's some really little one that I'm like what am I gonna do with that like what am I gonna do with this size <laughs> <laughs> Is this like a postcard you take with you in your wallet? <laughs> and then I also came, it also came with these sizes, which are, again, like, I don't know what I'm going to do with these sizes. This is the only realistic one, and this one is still kind of small, but I'm going to make it work. So, I was thinking of painting, I don't know, I'm kind of going for like the old aesthetic, like a fruit bowl. I also think it'll be a lot easier than something else, but I want to get creative with it. So maybe like a vineyard with a staircase in it and, and the staircase leads to another dimension. Uh, you know what? I don't really know how this is going to go down. I'm like talking out of my butt. So these are eight by 10. So it gives you reference. I want to show you guys what I'm looking at. Oh, you can kind of see it. I have a little fan blowing in the back. So, I've moved this here. That way I have access to my water. So I put it in a solo cup. That way I can just throw it out when I'm done. And I lit a citronella candle for the mosquitoes because there are mosquitoes and I'm already starting to feel like I'm getting bit. My dog wants to join us. Come. <laughs> Say hi. Bye, Jess. Over there. Hey, hey, over there. She's not interested. I feel like an artist. Okay, so I will open the colors as I go. That way I don't just have 10 million colors on here so here we go oh, that's such a pretty blue actually if I show you it might drop <laughs> Ooh. I have no idea what I'm doing <laughs> Am I supposed to continue holding this? I already have paint on my easel. That's okay. So it's kind of strokey. I wonder if there's a technique to this. Probably is, but your girl's not an artist, so. I totally understand why people pay to go do a wine and paint night. Because I feel like this would be so much fun drunk. Or is it just me? Because you literally are, like, you have no idea what you're going to make. No idea. 
I want to do like trippy white and black stairs that lead to nowhere like in Alice in Wonderland so or should I do a f oh wait maybe I should do a bold color and then do the white and black stairs so let's see what color shall I do excuse me sir I'm vlogging do you imagine if you actually heard me that'd be so embarrassing so I've decided I'm gonna do dark green so I can make it look like I'm in a forest where I find these stairs that lead to another dimension. Maybe I'll draw some trees and kind of mysterious and dark so it looks like uh, it's not my day. They ask you how you are, you just have to say that you're fine when you're not really fine, but you just can't get into it because they would never run. Oh God, I just... Do you want to paint for me? I saw a dog on TikTok do it. I can teach you. Y'all. So, like I said, I'm no artist, but I kind of don't mind it so far. Hold on. So I've added a few colors. Oof. Added a few colors. And I have two canvases now. I'm letting one dry. That way I can start doing the staircases on one. And then the other one, I started drawing the branches with the little flowers so i'm going to show you what i have so far excuse me sir oh it's starting to rain no 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 y'all it started to rain oh so i'm gonna have to put you here while i paint do you want to see what I have so far? It's not bad, right? I'm using this color for the flowers. And I'm actually, I'm kind of proud. I'm like not doing such a bad job. You definitely have to be patient though because paint takes a long time. Can you guys hear the rain? This is so nice, painting in the rain. So as I was saying, you have to be really patient with paint because it takes a long time to dry. And there's literally no going back. So you have to like overthink every little step. But this is my first painting ever, so I'm not criticizing myself hard. I'm just happy that it's coming out kind of decent. Y'all, it's raining so hard. Oh my gosh, look at this. This is so peaceful. I love this. It's slightly calming down now. ASMR vibes. <laughs> So I had to move all my stuff inside because it was getting wet. So let me set this all up and we'll continue painting. Y'all, so I dropped my phone trying to bring everything in so it wouldn't get wet and I cracked it. So I'm seeing a, a little crack on the screen. But it stopped raining and it's really pretty out. So I'm gonna reinstall everything so I can paint outside again. Hello, I am back. So. This is where I left off. So I'm gonna paint another flower right here and then I'm not sure, maybe make a few more branches or write a secret note inside of the branch. I'm not sure, I don't know. I'm just gonna let my mind do what it wants. And it looks like this one is dry. So I'm going to attempt to create a never ending staircase look into another dimension. So, uh, bear with me. <laughs> this is what I have so far I really like this one although I ruined this flower but 
on this one i originally had i don't know if you can kind of see it i drew like a staircase up here it was in white it was white and black but it didn't look nice and then i tried to do like a star starry night here and it just it was a no-go so i painted it all black and i think i'm gonna draw like a half moon here that way it's like day and night or just like two different kind of emotions going on so i'm gonna let this one dry and then i'm gonna start a third canvas <laughs> okay you know this one's already ruined so if it comes out bad don't cry about it don't cry over spilled milk because it's already happened Over how bad this is. Are you ready? <laughs> no, 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 no. <laughs> I just got paint on me. Well, I guess you're not a true artist until you get paint on you, huh? Well, I'm glad I'm not wearing anything I care about. See, I was smart. I was smart. So I guess I'll just let that dry. Oh my gosh, I'm just getting it everywhere. So these are just kind of like abstract with nothing really going on. They're simple, but complex. Then I have these on the wall. Look at this. Isn't this just so aesthetically pleasing? Or is it just me? Here, maybe. Those are the colors I didn't use. If I add this to it. Oh. Just look at that. Oh, patches. Hello. <laughs> oh, I didn't realize you could see me. Hello. Say hi, patches. <laughs> Okay, I'm going to have dinner now and pick this up tomorrow. Bye. Good morning. Can you tell I just woke up? <laughs> so I found a new coffee yesterday. It's a limited edition maple pecan flavored coffee. I'm kind of really excited. <gasps> I just got a little whiff of it. That smells so good. Oh my gosh, it literally smells so the trick of french press is you have to be patient and you don't push it all the way down so you push until you feel the water and then you just let it sit there for five minutes and then you push all the way down. That way the grounds don't come up. So be back in five. 